G'day everyone, Daniel O'Grady here and welcome to another Wasabi Cars video. Thank you all very much for joining me. And today I've got a super special car for you all. Now yesterday I went to the 2015 Fukuoka Custom Car Show, had a great time there. And uh, yeah, I went to the LB Performance booth, uh, this Lamborghini looking pretty sharp, this Ferrari also looking pretty sharp. But the third car was the car that I went to the car show to see. Yes, it's the Ken Mary. GC111 Skyline of Kato Wataru. And it does not bother me in the slightest that this is a modified car. You know, look, I love my cars to be, you know, original stock and all that, but this just looks right. It looks classic. It looks, it's just so unique and special that I'm just loving everything about this car. First thing that really surprised me is the paint actually. The, uh, the color is ice blue pearl and in it are blue flakes. Now, in photos I'd seen previously, I couldn't pick up on those flakes and to see it in person, it really is spectacular. So some of the external body mods, we've got some spoilers. On the front we've got that chin spoiler, looking pretty sharp. Out the back we've got a three-piece duck tail spoiler, looking great. The bolt-on three-piece looks fantastic. When you see them molded in, it's just, um, I don't know, it detracts from the shape a bit, but um, this one is looking very, very nice. Also, the rear has been blanked off. There's not much going on except for some tail lights. These tail lights come from the Nissan Cherry and are favored amongst the uh, Borsozoku crowd. But other than that, there really is not much going on back there. But uh, it's a nice, beautiful, clean look. I do like it. Now, this is a collaboration between LB Performance and Mizuno Works. And uh, there are, are a few parts on the outside of the car. The over fenders, for example, they are Mizuno Works items as are some other parts that I will talk about in a few moments. So up front we've got those tilted headlights, we've got an external mounted oil cooler, and that grill, that grill is from a C130 Nissan Laurel. The inside has been taken out and replaced with a mesh. Now quite often we see these cars with fender mounted side mirrors. These have been replaced with really compact units and sit on the doors. Okay, let's check it under the hood. Now, originally there was a two liter engine that has since been replaced with an L28 engine, which has in turn been bored out to over 3.1 liters. And apparently it now produces over 300 horsepower. And what I'm really loving about this engine bay is they haven't been too fussy. It looks like a real street car. I'm glad the driver's side window was down because I got to have a good look inside. Now the dash, of course, it's been all ripped out. We've got some fabricated sheet. Now this car doesn't even have a speedometer. It's got a taco. That's all he needs. Well, there are another three gauges there which um, measure various things. Also, there's the fuel pressure gauge sitting rather prominently there and also a sound system on the left. The seats are looking pretty sweet. They are old Datsun sports seats. Also, you can see the uh, half roll cage also by Mizuno Works and in yellow, beautifully contrasts with the blue of the car. So there you go. That is the beautiful ice blue pearl Ken Mary of Kato Wataru. And what a gentleman he is. He posed in this picture with me, so that was very kind of him. And all of the staff there, the sales staff and also the um, promotion girls, all very friendly. And uh, it just made for a, a fantastic experience. Now, I did buy this there it was 3,000 yen and uh, that, that money that I spent was actually my train uh, sorry bus money back to Hakata train station so I had to walk so question of the day is how far would you walk for this model and on a scale of 1 to 24 I'd give it 10 out of 10 in addition to this model I also got this book LB performance catalog book featuring all of their beautiful cars and body kits and prices in American dollars and yen. So um, that's a pretty unique thing. Very, very interesting. So yeah, thank you very much, Kato-san, and uh, to everyone and to all of you. So thank you very much for joining me and take it easy. Goodbye. With a little bit of rust and a little bit of dirt on wasabi gals and a little bit of wasabi.